we don't buy into this ancient primitive book of contradictory and unhistorical and unscientific words. These are just words on a page. This book was written by human beings. Human beings make mistakes. What, were they exempt? Were they superhumans or something? Did they never misinterpret? Did they, ever, did they never goof? Why are you conferring some supernatural authority to these human beings? That, and they're in all religions as well. If you look at the Bible, with not a bias of faith and loyalty, you can see very easily that this is not a reliable book to base our life on. But most of your arguments are based on quoting the scripture as if it was some kind of a magic talisman. Oh, quote the Bible, that will make everything important. Well, it doesn't. If you don't buy into that myth in the first place, if you don't see yourself as sick, if you don't see yourself as needing a savior, if you rise above that toddler mentality of putting yourself down, of denigrating your rationality, denigrating your whatever urges you have to sin within you, and we all have them. But view yourself neutrally as a natural creature in the natural environment, doing the best we can to truly figure out how to be moral human beings with reason and compassion, then you could be a better person. I'm not saying you're a bad person, but get rid of the baggage. Get, rid, get the monkey off your back and, and take some advice of Jesus. Don't be one of the sick people that has to go to the doctor.